Look, when people throw their hooks, throw it one, throw it two, throw it three. Most times what a lot of people do is when they throw their hooks, they always come right back here. They come back squared up. That's why you got to do something behind your hook. You either got to roll a hook or you got to bring a tooth back. That way you can always come back here. So if you go here, one, two, three, that's why you got to throw, now reset. It makes it easy for his reset, right? But if he did one, two, and he throw a three and he end up coming back, he's squaring himself right back up. Cool. So you go one, two, three, roll. It makes it easier for him to come back here. You see what I'm saying? So you got to be careful when you throw them hooks. Right, you gotta make sure you bring some behind it. Either roll it or bring a two behind it. Those are some of the basic fundamental things you guys can do. All right, leave me alone. Bye. Again, again, again. Come here. I, I see it. Come here. I see it from here. Come here. Come here. I don't no, see no, it. No, I, I want y'all to see it. it. I want you to see it. See come it. here. I'll come in this corner. Go take a step back. This is why. This is why when you throw hooks, you gotta do some behind it. What's he doing, y'all? We're going right back. We're going right back to the same spot. You can uh, that is why you got to do something you behind your hook. Bop, because you would bop. square back up on your hook. Bop, bop. You going here. Bop, bop. 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 And you, it's like, it's like, you it's like a reaction thing. And you coming in and bop. the counter for the three is a two. two. So if you square back up, you're going to get hit with a two. two. There you go.